Hey there, if you're looking for a fun and easy way to earn rewards, including cash and prizes, check out the link in the video description. Welcome to Reality Check, where we dive deep into the drama and emotions of your favorite reality TV shows. Today, we're dissecting Carl Radke's behavior towards Lindsay Hubbard in Season 8 of Summer House. Let's explore the highs, the lows, and everything in between. Carl Radke regrets the way he treated his ex-fiancée, Lindsay Hubbard, as cameras rolled for Summer House, Season 8. I'm not proud of how I was handling the situation and how I was treating her, Radke told the New York Times Friday. I mean, I was clearly frustrated, and you know, so I wish I had really been more direct. The reinstated Loverboy Rep 39 pointed out that viewers can clearly see him struggling to communicate his feelings, insisting that that was his own fault. That's not on her, that's on me. I'm seeing myself blame and play victim, and I don't want to be either, he explained. Throughout the season, Radke and Hubbard, 37, argued over nearly everything. Their communication skills were lacking, and as fans saw in the reunion preview, Radk was admittedly scared of Hubbard. With each passing week, he grew more and more frustrated with his then-soon-to-be wife, who at one point even questioned his sobriety. Radk filmed conversations with several co-stars and even his parents about his concerns with his relationship, but when it came time to talk to Hubbard, he beat around the bush. Hubbard, for her part, felt Radk had an angry side, a glimpse of which was shown in the season finale when he told her that her personality can be a f-king lot. It wasn't until after the season had officially wrapped that production quickly picked back up to capture Rag dumping Hubbard in their shared New York City apartment. During the tense scene, Rag accused the former PR executive of not caring about his feelings and always playing the victim. Now that nine months have passed since they ended their engagement, Rack has no regrets about pulling the plug, even if he did so only two and a half months before their wedding. He told Andy Cohen on Watch What Happens Live earlier this month that he made the right decision, and Hubbard happens to agree. In fact, she told Glamour Thursday that she feels she dodged a massive bullet, adding, I really truly feel thankful that the universe or God or whatever higher being you believe in stepped in and saved me from a really long, hard, rough life ahead. Wendt.